Yo, what's going on, y'all, man? Welcome to another episode of Marty Mar, man. Y'all know this is gonna be a banger. You know what I'm talking about? Recording on the same day, dropping on the same day. It's starting to become a thing. I'm starting to kind of like it. It's more stressful and shit, but especially at the end of the night when I gotta edit it and then drop it, it's been like right on the dot at 12, y'all. It's like cutting it real close. Um, you know, because I'm trying to bring y'all as much time as I can. But if y'all didn't check the last video out, please go check it out. It's got a lot of events in it. And it was a dope video. Dope video. Make sure y'all sharing me, man, to y'all friends and family. If y'all know somebody that watches YouTube all the time, send them my YouTube. If y'all know somebody that you think can get inspired or motivated by me, send them my YouTube. If y'all know somebody that's always talking about wanting to start their own YouTube or anything like that, share my channel, guys, so that... Um, you know, I can win and they can win. You feel me? They can learn some shit. Um, and if they need help, they can always DM me on Instagram. Stuff like that. But, today, I'm going to go shit fishing for the first time ever. I've never went fishing in my life. Um, TJ says it's like his favorite, most favorite thing to do. Uh, and we're going with 75. And I think it's just us three. And we're just going to kick it, I guess, you know? I don't know what fishing is like. But I know that... Uh, I'm competitive, so I'm gonna try to get the biggest fish. You feel me? <clears throat> but today is Tuesday. Wait, am I wrong? What day is it today, gang? Yeah, today's Tuesday, April 12th. I uh, hope everybody is having a marvelous day or had a marvelous day. You know, and if you didn't, make sure you finish it off strong. Uh, don't ever be in a bad mood, man. That's just horrible. Always, always go to sleep with a smile and knowing that tomorrow or the next day is a new day feel what I'm talking about but right now we on the highway game ah. oh shit too much wind too much wind I know we got the top down ah. yes yeah, sir but what y'all do today what y'all have planned today comment below what y'all did today man I need more interactions on the comment log like I get a couple some decent views and it's like I don't get the comments to match it. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting the likes. I'm getting over a thousand likes each video, so I definitely appreciate that. Um, it's a blessing to be able to get that. I remember I, I used to dream about that, guys. I remember I used to dream about getting 10,000 views, 15,000 views, 20,000 views, 30,000 views. You know, that King Sid video, I'm at 125,000 views on that. So that's my biggest video. It's just crazy, um, you know, when you find drama and you... Uh, Connected with somebody that's, you know, got two million subscribers, uh, and you say they got knocked out with a little bit of cabin over exaggerating. He did get knocked down. He did fall on the floor. He did get rocked in the jaw. His hat did go flying, but he didn't get knocked out, gang. Uh, yeah, guys, you know it's a lot of over exaggerating on the titles and thumbnails man your favorite youtuber does it everybody does it guys it's just to get you to go ahead and click on that video um, and you know show support it's messed up because you wouldn't do that if it had a regular title the same people that be mad about the thumbnail title is because those people wouldn't even have clicked on it if it wasn't for that thumbnail title it's so weird guys i don't know if y'all can hear me i'm trying to talk loud but i had to start a vlog right now while on the highway and to scoop cj up um he told me to be there at 1030. I bet you money, he still ain't gonna be ready. Good old CJ. <laughs> but, yeah, man, I'm about to have some fun. I'm about to learn how to fish. Hopefully, I don't fall in the water. And, uh, you know, I'm just getting ready to just try something new. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna be vlogging this experience or not, but at least I'm gonna start the intro for today, guys. And then once we leave, um, I'll figure out what to do from there. You get what I'm saying? But,. I got some exciting shit coming, guys, so make sure y'all hitting that bell. Hit the bell, or else subscribe don't count. Plus, every time I drop, plus every time that I drop, uh, you guys will get notified that I drop so you guys can be on top of it. But big shout out to everybody that's out there watching me, <clears throat> especially daily, the ones that try their best to keep up with me. I pretty much just can't believe it, and I love you guys. You guys are literally family. Um, and, you know, I, I love to do collabs with you guys, man. It's just, right now, super busy. And I got to charge, y'all. This, this is my main income. Unless we see each other 
we cross paths, y'all come to an event or something, I'm always showing love, promotions for free. But if y'all personally asking me for some of my time, I gotta charge that bag. If y'all want a shout out, I gotta charge that bag. It's actually a really small bag, I'm charging really little. So it's not a lot, guys, but become a member, guys. Become a member to my YouTube channel. Uh, the, the, the Becoming a member link is in my description. Uh, as far as also with my Instagram and Facebook and all that stuff is in there. But appreciate you guys, man. Stay tuned. There's going to be a lot that you're going to see. I don't know what you're going to see, but you never know what I record again. See you on a bit. All right, guys. So I pulled up to CJ house, gave him a call. He won't answer. He told me to be there about 1030, but I know he went to sleep late as hell last night. I called 75, he didn't answer. 75, call me back like, CJ not answering? I'm like, nope. He like, well, come to me, and then we finna get you your bike. And then uh, by then, hopefully he wake up. So guys, everybody go to CJ YouTube right now and tell him to wake the fuck up. But yeah. I got up early as hell. I feel good though. I like getting up early. <laughs> so we finna pull up on 75. Get this bike. I didn't even know I was getting a bike. I don't know how this fishing shit goes, gang. So we finna check it out. But I'm finna be right, right back with y'all, man. Uh, stay tuned. I guess I'm finna vlog the fishing experience. I don't know yet. Maybe not. Maybe so. I don't know. Stay tuned. I'll be right back. Alright, gang. So I'm with 75 still. CJ finally texted us. He's up, so I guess we're gonna get go get him in a bit. But we had to get stuff ready, anyways. But man, they got some nice old schools over here, man. I like them. I'm an old school type of guy. What up? What up? Nice ass old school. Shit, I'm with 75. Oh, yeah. recording here, oh you wanna record this? Yeah. Alright guys, we made it to 75 plays. We finna go screw CJ up. He woke up. This dog is huge. He's bigger than me. Bro, that dog that dog is bigger than me, bro. That's sad. You say what? I had a dog in front of my like, left feet. Oh, I think so. That's it. The one I just showed you right now, the picture. Oh, let me. Uh, I'll show you right now. Yeah, you got to show me again. That motherfucker big as hell, though. Yeah, we in 75 garage. I never been here, so it's fucking dope to be in here because I always seen it in videos. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Sheesh. Oh, I seen. I like this two door a lot, bro. This damn truck is nasty. I love these bottle, these styles. So what, like you guys are working on it or something? Yeah, that's what I gotta get finished. Yeah, we need to take it to, to, take it to Texas uh, next week. I mean, uh, next month. Damn. Love these motherfuckers. So you buy them like, you know, and you have to restore them type shit? Yeah, so. It came with the rims? True. No, 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 not these. It had, uh, it had the black ones. Oh, okay. Damn, this shit's dope as fuck, bro. Nice Caprice classic. With the maroon. Oh, that's the maroon, right? The maroon inside. Jeez. The bench seats. Damn, 75 just won all type of awards, huh? Just a little some, some slight. That's crazy, guy. Actually, never been here before, bro. Now I always wanted to come in here because I know this shit was look, always looking good on camera. Damn. Big Mexicano shit right there. Damn. So it's a whole upstairs in this bitch. You got a couch up there and shit. Yeah, I got a couch, TV. Come on, I'm gonna be Martin. <laughs> hey, I won't say no. Yes, yeah, sir. All right, well, shit, y'all get to see a little, little stuff from 75. I know y'all see it all the time, but y'all never seen it on my channel. Man, that dog is so damn big, guys. That dog is mean as hell over there. Yeah. 
the the bigger one is older, huh? Like old, old. Oh shit, he's young. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go up the steps. Yeah, got a whole little kicky spot with the with the chase, sofa chase. Well, guys, we're gonna be right back. We're gonna go fishing. All right, guys, so I'm about to open this package that Mr. Khalif gave me. He been telling me to open this up. He sent it to Al a long time ago. So it says, Marty Mar, first and foremost, you already know, big up from Japan, and big shout out to you for grinding so hard to keep the content coming. I hope you enjoy the snacks. I tried to include a large variety of items, just keeping it a band. Most of these snacks I've never tried myself, so I have no idea what they taste like. I try to stay away from snacks that have shellfish in them because I'm not sure if you or any of the baddies you decide to make the taste test video with may have allergies to shellfish. Didn't want to take any chances. You and the rest of the gang are inspiring me. Pick up my camera and start grinding. I've started dropping videos on my YouTube channel now. I didn't even realize how difficult it is to talk to yourself on camera. I thought it would be easier, especially when I literally talk to myself in my head all the time. LMAO. And the copyright thing is crazy. All videos. All videos that I've posted so far. Got Damn, all kinds of metal fabrication. Oh wait, what the hell? Well, anyways, guys, go subscribe to my guy, Kicking It With Khalif. Um, the time and dedication it takes to edit a video. It's time consuming. I can't see the full time job for some YouTubers. So a big shout out, CJ Stunner Reese, Red Real, and salute to my boy because you are on your way. Peace and blessings, Khalif Asid. So definitely big, appreciate Khalif. I'm about to try to see what these snacks look like. We got a bunch of snacks in here. So, shit, let's try these snacks on. A whole bunch of snacks. Damn, a whole bunch of snacks in this bitch. Look at this. Okay, got these snacks. We got these snacks. Damn. Okay. These snacks. Khalif really went hard in the paint, gang. No cap. I can't read none of this shit. It's literally from Japan. I don't know what's going on. Damn, this shit look tasty, though. Some tamales or some shit, look like. Some type of bread. Some type of chocolate. And this dude sent me a bunch of candies, bro, from Japan. Hell yeah. Alright, man. Ooh, these look good. Yeah, you know, these gotta be good. Pokey. The fudge. He's like, I guess nuts. Ew. I'm in the fish. Hell no. Nah. Come on, Khalif. Don't get me sick, my boy. What's this? Some peanut butter. That should look good. And what else we got? Last but not least, I don't know what that shit is. Oh no, we got one more thing in here, I think. Nope, that's it. And that's gonna be it. Well, Khalif, appreciate you, man. And I'm definitely gonna try some of these candies out right now, because I'm definitely hungry as hell. And I'm gonna be letting y'all know these guys trying to figure this out. I'm gonna be right back.
need more your brother, bro. Yeah, dude. It's in the other one. The big pocket or little pocket? Little pocket. Come on, boy. Why aren't you moving? <laughs> I think Juan got something, guys. Did you get something? Bro, what are you doing? <laughs> you're tweaking. So now what? You're trying to bring him back in? You're trying to reel him in? Nice. Gonna have a big ass shark just come and get one. I guess that happens a lot, doesn't it? Over here is hooked on his first fish. Oh, oh, look at my boy! My boy! Hey! Yeah, look, that's your twin, my boy! <laughs> Hell no! Marty just caught his first fish, man. Got a mustache, gang. Yeah. It's an amigo. Call up before this rookie right here. This shit jumped off. Mike came right on. Yeah, man. Oh, he get on his damn side. We got my boy Marty Mart out here at the lake. We're doing something different today. We're relaxing. Y'all know I love the lake. I love the lake. Why not bring my boy Marty Mart to experience something different, man? Look at him. Look at him. Hey, Marty Mart Jr. Yeah, yeah. What up, gang? What's his name? Mustache shit. Don't call his ass Marty Mart. Marty Mart. Look at him, man. Ugly so now what we do? The channel cats getting big here, like the bears we use for bait. Now look at him. Look at his mouth. He's the small ones. Why you doing that? Can we cut him up, you said? No, we already, we already got bait out. We're going to catch them all day. Tell them, Juan. Oh, so those are the easy fish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you have on that? What is that? Nightcrawl? You said what? Oh, look, he's right there. He's chilling ground when it rains. 
Oh shit, it's a damn worm. They like worms? That's crazy. I did not know that. Wait, what happened here? There's some type of murder scene. Yeah, somebody killed somebody here, gang. <laughs> Alright, I don't know what he's talking about, gang. I'm going to be right back. Guys, this video is brought to you by the Griffin family, man. Anybody that's part of 32 Gang knows who the Griffin family is, man. They show us major love. It is sponsored by them. This video would not be possible if it was not for the Griffin family. So, definitely appreciate the Griffin family. I hope nothing but the best for him and his wife um, and his daughters. Um, you guys are all excellent people. They've actually went to the strip club with us before and teed up. Um, they've been to every event that we be at. So definitely appreciate you guys so much. Um, and it's always a pleasure seeing you guys. And I hope you guys are doing well. They always watch our videos, guys. They watch not just mine, but everybody's videos. Um, so I just really appreciate it when you got people like that in your life that's actually showing you love, guys. Um, so once again, guys, big shout out to the Griffin family. And I'm going to be putting their links in my description. And I need you guys who's watching this to really go over there and follow and subscribe to them. I can already tell you don't even see need to check their content. It's actually really lit. And they on some hustling shit, gang. So please go over there and support them. Tell them that Marty Mar sent y'all. Um, and I appreciate everybody that uh, you know actually shows love to the people that are sponsoring the videos. Because you wouldn't be able to watch it if it wasn't for them, guys. There's money that I invest in these videos. And these shoutouts are helping me invest in these videos. And they are, um, you know, people that sponsored for me to have this video. So... Definitely appreciate the Griffin family. I hope nothing but the best for you guys. Big 32 gang, y'all official with it. No cat, we got y'all. Um, and y'all have a blessed rest of the day. Oh, don't leave the video, guys. There's still a lot more to come. See y'all in a bit. All right, guys. Martin got another one. Look at him. Oh. I think he got my line. Same one. He got my line. Hey, walk, like walk towards it. Took my boy out the hood. It took him Yeah, hold the pole down, though. Point it towards the bar. Right. Is the fish still on that hook? Man, he gonna break the line, bro. <laughs> Slimy, it's all right. You fishing? Ain't no women out here. It's like super slippery. This guy. <laughs> you got him. Oh, my boy, you got him. Look. <laughs> okay, Marty. Good luck, my boy. Broke the line. You broke the line. Nowhere, buddy. This nigga it's broke the hook. No, nah, they look the same. They ain't the same. They all gonna be that size. Look. <laughs> His mustache is not even. Hold on. Look at the thumbnail. <laughs> got Martin out here catching catfish. So what? Just throw him out? No, no. We gotta get the line out, right? Man, he got that hook in his lip. Let me take it out so I can throw his ass back. What's 
that? Go throw them in the water, bro. Go throw them in the water? I'm not taking shit home. I like fish anyway. Perfect example. I need the other type of fish though. Oh, uh, that's it right here. <laughs> no, no. Probably better for you than that one. No, no. <laughs> bye bye. Well, there goes, there goes another one. Yeah, there goes another one. How does that happen? By breaking it? Yes. <laughs> Damn, I want, I want to see a big one. Right spot, guys. We had super technical difficulties coming here. Jeez. Swear to God. What wires? The dog bit up the wires. Oh, the yeah. Wire. And the butt. <laughs> and and right here, the dog bit up. Dog bit all these wires. Gotta put some tape. It was bad, guys. It was bad. Damn. Well. Stay tuned, because there's a, um, well, I mean, technically, I just went to go get it. <laughs> Whatever. He coming back to watch. He gonna come back? Baby, come back to me, because in my heart we are meant to be together. Oh, it was nothing. Yeah. You gotta get you some friends like me. You know oh yeah. I get the cruise and, you know I, I help you work out. You get a <laughs> man. You get a lot of stimulus. So oh yeah, my legs definitely gotta work out. You ain't gotta put them up. No, man. they don't even understand. We came from all the way over there, and this man wants to go. Look, we like luckily got to stop here because his tire went flat. He wants to go all the way over there. Well, that's where we always go. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> hey, man, just say I'm looking out for you, so you ain't lazy. Oh, no, no, no. Never lazy. You gotta work them legs out, man. Never lazy. Always working. We stay up. The next one is going to... Damn, my hair's all over the place, Dan. Y'all ain't even tell me. That's crazy. You said... Marty Mart over here, boy, getting down. Look at the amigo. Hold on, damn, did he get off? Keep reeling, my boy. Oh, never. Oh, my God. This dude had a good one. Man, your ass is fire. This guy fired, too. What the hell you get caught on? Oh, my God. Y'all suck, man. Well, Martin got his third fish up here on the bank. Did you have my line or no? Damn, Martin broke his line. How did that happen? You broke some braided line, too. That would be a big one, right? Yeah, your shit was bent over. His shit was pissed. <laughs> your ass is permanently fired from fishing. My check.
far game, that's when you get them, you feel me? You gotta, you gotta throw all the way out there. So pointy, good guys. eater. Man, he stick the shit out of when it burn and hurt bad as hell. I bet, shit. Fuck. All right, well, I caught me a blue. Caught you a blue. You feel me? Fat belly too. They eating good. They probably, they probably taste good too. Cook them up. Yeah. Better than channels. <laughs> they expensive? All right. All right. What are you doing? <laughs> huh? You wanna go back in the water? Okay. <laughs> They're like about the same. This is sperm. But you're walking your fish. He's having a I never thought I'd be doing no shit like this, bro. It's too, like, gooey for me. Like, I don't like to feel it. Hell yeah! <laughs> By the way, fuck Ashley Furniture. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. Hey, what is it today? Today's Tuesday? I would have been at Ashley Furniture till 9 today. Fuck that. Hey, CJ used to call me at, like, 3 p.m. every day on Tuesday. Like, what you doing? I'm like, bro, I'm at work. <laughs> He'd be like, damn, they got you on a slave ship. <laughs> He did? Yeah, you did. Mm-mm. Right, gang, bro. I'll let y'all. Jumping out the gym. I'll let y'all in a bit. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm.
fingers though. I got the Oh, that's a nice one. Damn. My boy. Jeez. That's my boy. Oops. Because we gotta throw this guy. Oh no, here, give me, throw him out. Right, guys I came to my old home where I used to live at man none of my family lives here anymore um, it's the old house in the hood on the west side man on Pleasant Street where you can have a pleasant time and that's what I always tell people before but anyways I want to address you know when I said that I've been shot at multiple, multiple times um, the other day in my video um, I said shot um, I've been shot but I actually been shot at I was never got hit with a gun or a bullet um, but I definitely got shot at right here where I'm sitting where I'm at right now where I'm at right now um, I was parked here um, and two guys ran up to me um, and started shooting their weapon and hit my car three times with my old bins I had before here um, they started shooting at me for where that tree is at over there y'all see that tree right there that's where the dude started shooting at me at um, and I'm part of where I'm at right now. So it was a very close call. Um, luckily, I was able to get away. Um, you know, I went to the Joliet Police Station down the street. Um, I've also been robbed at this house right here in the back uh, with a gun into my head. Um, at the street behind there, the, not that street, that little alleyway, but the other one, um, my guy shot at somebody, you know, that was running after us. So he sh threw his bike down and started shooting his Magnum he had. So that is to clear up people that were saying, man, why you say you got shot and you didn't get shot? What's the real story? Real story is that I didn't get shot, but I got shot at three times, guys, in front of my mom's house, which is why I moved up north. I still don't know who it is. People are probably like, why you still drive through over there? Man, I still had a lot of love here. The other day I drove through here, I had three guys say, Marty Mars. So, you know, I still have a lot of love here. People know where I'm from, man. I'm always gonna represent the West Side Joliet. Uh, you know, I'm always gonna represent 815 period, but I have West Side tattoo on my chest, so. Um, it's just where I'm from, man. I got shot here, I could have died, I could have been dead right now, nobody would ever solve the murder, because we couldn't even find them who, when they shot at, shot at me, so. Um, I was never in the game, guys. Uh, I just think that people just always looked at me like an easy lick, or rob, but I hope they know it ain't like that no more, guys. Um, you know, I stay, I stay with my shit now, and I'm not trying to brag, but, you know, I'm legal and, you know, I'm allowed to protect myself now. 
also back in the day I feel like you know I didn't I didn't used to believe in guns I used to always believe in hands nowadays everything's about guns but you know I've been robbed a lot of times yeah guys and right here where I'm at now this is where I grew up at on Pleasant Street from five years old all the way to when I moved out to 23 guys so um, you know I've changed a lot I came from a long from a really bad past but I can only get better so I'm gonna finish hitting this block because I always hit the block over here. Uh, then I'm gonna go to the east side, and I'm gonna go home, man. So, like I said, I represent west and east side, but the west side is where I grew up from, man. Big west side shit, man. Y'all know what's up. All right, guys, I'm gonna be back. I just wanted to clear up that stuff from people were asking me, you know, why did I say that in the thumbnail and title and all that stuff. Stuff actually really happened, just not. You know, I gotta over exaggerate sometimes, guys. But <clears throat> all right, guys, I'm gonna finish hitting these blocks, and I'm gonna be right back with y'all. All right, gang, I made it home after a long day of fishing, and y'all know I came out victorious. They call it beginner's luck, but I caught about four fishes on my own. Two fishes CJ assisted me on. Um, I guess they were called Chanel's. And on my own, I got the blues. I don't know what that stuff means, but all I know is I went hard in the paint. You feel me? And I want to go back fishing again. And I got a workout in there because where CJ wants to go is super far. And he got like the gas one. I'm on a, I'm on a regular bike. So I was using my leg power. Luckily, his um, something happened where the tire went flat. So we had to stop in the middle, which saved me some leg power. You feel me? But anyway, guys, um, um, we about to go ahead and give a, uh, you know, adios to you guys, man. It was a pleasure. To whoever watched my whole video, man, I definitely appreciate it, man. I'm at home. I'm at peace. Whew. Y'all don't know how important that is, guys. I'm telling you. Anybody that's bothering your life or any type of drama or they just make you feel a certain way, just remove them from your life, guys. Like, ain't no reason. Ain't no need. Oh, yeah, somebody told me to remove my glasses so that you don't see the, um, you know, the, the, the balls or whatever, the little circles. That was a good suggestion, by the way. But... Um, ain't no reason to be stressed, guys, over nobody. Ain't nobody worth it, man. I'm telling you right now, nobody's worth your stress or your peace. Don't let nobody get in between that. Um, the sooner you realize that, the, f the happier you'll be in life, and the more um good will come to you. Because when you're worried about other people, then sometimes you bring their problems in your world. When you're worried about you and um you focus on fixing you what you got in front of you, then stuff comes out better for you and you feel better. You feel me? But anyways, guys. That's enough with the rants, and I hope y'all enjoyed my first time ever fishing vlog, um, and I went crazy in it. You feel me when I'm talking about? But Marty Mars checking out, man. Adios. Guys, this video is brought to you by the Griffin family, man. Anybody that's part of 32 Gang knows who the Griffin family is, man. They show us major love. It is sponsored by them. This video would not be possible if it was not for the Griffin family. So definitely appreciate the Griffin family. I hope nothing but the best for him and his wife. Um, and his daughters, um, you guys are all excellent people. They've actually went to the strip club with us before and teed up. Um, they've been to every event that we be at. So definitely appreciate you guys so much. Um, and it's always a pleasure seeing you guys. And I hope you guys are doing well. They always watch our videos, guys. They watch not just mine, but everybody's videos. Um, so I just really appreciate it when you got people like that in your life that's actually showing you love, guys. Um, so... Once again, guys, big shout out to the Griffin family, and I'm going to be putting their links in my description. And I need you guys who's watching this to really go over there and follow and subscribe to them. I can already tell you don't even see, need to check their content. It's actually really lit, and they on some hustling shit, gang. So please go over there and support them. Tell them that Marty Mar sent y'all. Um, and I appreciate everybody that uh, you know actually shows love to the people that are sponsoring the videos because you wouldn't be able to watch it if it wasn't for them, guys. There's money that I invest in these videos. And these shout outs are helping me invest in these videos. And they are, um, you know, people that are sponsored for me to have this video. So definitely appreciate the Griffin family. I hope nothing but the best for you guys. Big 32 gang, y'all official with it. No cat, we got y'all. Um, and y'all have a blessed rest of the day. Oh, don't leave the video, guys. There's still a lot more to come. See y'all in a bit.